Welcome to video from the digitallifestyle.com. Two for the one again with the builds in this video. We'll be looking at 23481 for Windows Insiders on the dev channel. Plus we've also got 25393 for Windows Insiders on the Canary channel. Now with the Canary one that there is no blog post to go with it. So we haven't got any details uh, of what's new in there. But I thought I'd let you know that there is this build. And I think there's a, a widget that's applicable to both builds. So we'll have a look at that. So uh, in widgets... There's the new widget for focus sessions, so you can add that. Uh, you notice the canary, it still shows the old uh, widget picker, but oh yeah, that you can start a focus session from here. So that's uh, new in the canary, and I think that is also in the dev. Other than that, that's the only change that I've seen uh, with this build so far. I might find some other uh, other stuff, but uh, that, yeah, that's all I've seen so far. If I go over to the Dev build 23481. We do have some release notes for that, and um, one of the changes is around pen input. Now, I've got a pen on this is a virtual machine on a Surface Laptop Studio, but the pen doesn't pass through, so I can't try it. But Microsoft do say this feature is only just rolled out, so I probably haven't got it anyway. But just in case, I'm installing this build on an old Surface Go that's got pen support, so I'll be able to try it. So, here's the picture you can write into the into the UI boxes and um, it should have better recognition and then um, you'll be able to interact with this with the system or the shell using the pen you can kind of at the moment anyway so if I get a, a text box yeah you know, I can I can write into this box uh, and I can input so I'm not sure what exactly the difference is we'll have to wait and see the setting so that's the setting on the current version and the setting here looks the same so it looks like i haven't got that new setting anyway like i said i'll try it with my other uh, surface device right so other changes with this build the uh, folder options in this some of the options have been removed um so they've got things like uh display file icons on thumbnails and high protected os files um show pop-up descriptions for folder show encry encrypted repressed ntfs folders in color some of those options have been removed you can still get in the registry but they removed microsoft say to keep things simple around windows 11. i mentioned the widget that you just previously seen that's included in this build as well okay what else is new in this build the So what else is new in this build? Well, the um, the free version of Teams, which I'm not sure many people use, is def is um, automatically pinned um, and can be unpinned from uh, from the settings. They are supposedly uh, working on this to improve the um, features on this, but I'm not sure that many people are using the free version of Teams. So uh, in the so previously it was kind of down here and uh, now it's just pinned there and you can unpin that if you want to there are some fixes for file explorer uh, where the content menu could be blurry there are some fixes with the modern address bar uh, i still haven't got the modern address bar so that's where it's uh, further up and that's not rolled out to everybody yet um, and they made some fixes with the taskbar fly out there are still some known issues a new one is the in file explorer the count shown for fi for selected files in details pane may be extremely large like this is the count down at the bottom i'm not quite sure it, but I, it, whether it's the count number may be high or the font is too high and there is a new um issue if you've got um, a url with three dots in it it will crash explorer there's some new issues with ink as well. You can't cor correctly erase ink in Edge and the address box in Edge may not work correctly. I'll give a bit more time to the uh, ink experience and the new build when I uh, get this installed on my Surface Go. Um, and I'll report back on a, probably next week's video or I'll do a separate one if, it's, if there's any major changes. So those are the changes with this build. Uh, 23481 and as you've seen the... Um, 
Canary Build 25393. Canary Build's not that interested at the moment. All the work's in the dev build. So thanks for watching this video. If you spot anything that I should be talking about, I'll include it in the next video. Let me know in at the slash style comma. Leave a comment. Thanks for watching the video, and I'll see you on the next one.